What's happening? Willie here with The Great Outdoors. Hey, not too long back you saw me go into the backyard and take these Blackbeard fire plugs that were sent to me by Ben from the Semper Gunby channel. Ben told me to give these things a shot. I said, okay, I will do that. That's what we did. We made a video. Well, then after I made that video, Ben contacted the Blackbeard fire plug people because uh, Ben is affiliated with those guys and said, hey, got a friend of mine that just did a video on your product you might want to watch. They did, and they liked what they saw. Well, I told y'all in that video that I, uh, I'm more of a kit kind of guy, and to have these fire plugs are great, um, but what I like to do is I like to have everything kind of in its own little package, so I know where to go to get everything I need for that particular situation Instead of having to go to a drawer over here and go to the garage out there and then again, I'm just that guy. I like to have everything in its little place. I am a, I am a list maker and I am a overpacker. I will tell you that right now. But I go by that philosophy. It is better to have and not need than to need and not have. I'm just that guy. Sorry, can't help that. It is what it is. But... After I did that video, I got online and I started looking up the Blackbeard Fire Company and I looked up the, um, the different things that they carried, different products that they had. And they did have a kit that was going to work out for me. Now, I ordered that kit and I have it right here. It came in the mail. That's right. I have been looking very forward to opening this. But first I want to tell you that uh, I talked with the Blackbeard Fire Company people and um, through YouTube we have affiliate programs that we that we do uh, some people do um, I at this point had not been involved in any type of affiliate program at all I'm not going to contact somebody and I'm not going to accept anything from anybody that doesn't work with this channel now I have been contacted by several others through this link and uh, I've had to turn them down because it just doesn't have anything to do with my channel. Um, I had a gun holster company contact me. Um, now, don't know why they thought that, I guess because I'm an outdoors channel and they saw outdoors, didn't watch the channel, they don't know what I do. Uh, they contacted me and wanted me to work and partner up with them. Well, guns are just not one of those things you see on this channel. And you're probably never going to. Do I have them? Yes. Could I use holsters? Yes. But would I ever promote a holster or a gun on the channel? No, probably not, because I'm not that type of channel. Now, on the other hand, Blackbeard Fire Company, different story. Once they contacted me and I looked at their product line and saw that they had a kit that I thought would be great for us, my wife and I, when we go camping, I said, you know what, this I wouldn't mind doing. So that's what I did, contacted them. I bought this kit, um, got it, you know, wasn't given to me. I, I didn't, you know, call them and say, hey, I'm gonna do a video on your stuff, can you send me something? That didn't happen, they, I bought this and they sent it to me and I was gonna open it up today and show you what the kit comes with. You've already seen, when I use these guys, what the fire plugs will do. Two little fire plugs ripped in half, started a bonfire in my backyard, in my fire pit. That would be great for me. That would be great for my wife at the campground because my wife is the queen of the campfires. She could sit around the campfire from the time the sun comes up to the time the sun goes down. She enjoys that. Me, I personally prefer to cook on it. I don't really use it for heat. I don't really just like to sit around by it or whatever. That's not my thing. I can sit for about seven to 10 minutes before I have to get up and put some line on a reel or, or drive the golf cart around the campground or go for a walk or a hike or whatever. That's just me. But when I contacted the Blackbeard Fire Company and let them know that I had bought a kit, the owner of the company, Mr. Thompson, and 
incredible guy. Um, incredible people that I talked to, Sarah. Um, just great people. Uh, and, and what I really like is the proudly made in the USA. And, uh, and these people are proud of their product. And that's good. That's very good. You don't hear that very often. And I, that was one of the things that uh, drew me to them. If I think it's a product that you can benefit from, it's a, you can get it at a good price and it will work for you and not just be broken sitting in the corner or you're going to throw it in a drawer and never see it again, I'm not going to tell you about it. So when I decided to move to the affiliate program with the Blackbeard Fire people, it's because I think I'm really going to enjoy using it. The reason that I am doing this today is because I wanted to tell you a little bit about this affiliate thing that I am now affiliated with them and I have a link that you can go to. I enjoy helping someone do something that I feel is a good, down-to-earth, legitimate company with people that are proud of their product. That's what I enjoy. Uh, let me just tell you about the ordering process. It was great, very easy, no different than being, say, on Amazon or anything else. You could click this, click that, your card, whatever. And from the time I did that, I received emails about the product being ordered, when it was shipped. They kept up to date uh, tracking on the, and it actually came two days early. Okay? So that is incredible to me. They kept up. And I actually kept in contact with the owner of the company through several different emails just talking back and forth. That's great. That's an awesome thing. So this kit that we're going to open up right now, I'm going to cut into this thing and uh, like we do with the fishing reels, we're going to get you down to the table here and we're going to show you what this kit entails and uh, in the near future you're going to see it out at the campground. But I just wanted to show you the kit in general and let's see what's inside the bag. First off, let's start off by saying the bag is absolutely cool. Tried, tested, and true. And that's that's a great thing right there. Now, let's how about I just tear the bag open here? Alright, what do we got first? Thank you for your purchase. www.blackbeardfire.com. And then of course YouTube, you got your at Blackbeardfire. Ooh. What do we got here? Free bag of fire plugs with your next order. All right, what's the first thing we're going to see right here? Okay. Fire plugs. That's what we're looking for. What do we got? Everything says the same. Start a fire anywhere, anytime. That's right. Any condition proudly made in the U.S. And they are in there with a 30-year shelf life, people. 30 years. I just can't get over that. That part really baffles me, the 30-year part. And then, of course, your directions on how to use it and it's tested and all that stuff. All right, I read that to you in the first video. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, now this is this is part of the kit. Here's, oh, look at that. That's cool. Opens up and you can put all of your stuff inside the bag here. You got, that's bungee. A little pocket. And the same thing on this side, another bungee, another pocket. A little clip, which is great for your keys and stuff, just in case, you know. Me, I'd put my keys in here and I would lose the entire kit. And of course, then the Velcro pocket on the front of the bag there. That's pretty cool. This is a plasma arc lighter. USB rechargeable. Now that's cool. Windproof arc, waterproof case, no fuel needed. Carry with confidence knowing that you have a fire ignition source for wherever adventure may take you. The Blackbeard Plasma Arc Lighter is one of a kind. Must have gadget, oh, must have gadget that is cutting edge. Features waterproof, windproof, and rechargeable. Includes a lanyard and USB charging cable. Blackbeard Fire Rod. Okay, now these are the spark rod things that you zip, 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 and that kind of stuff. Scan here for directions. That's cool, too, and I like the fact that you can do that. A uh, half-inch thick diameter, five inches long, throws a massive shower of hot sparks on a light fire. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Hot sparks to light a fire. Instantly in any condition. Good for up to 20,000 strikes. Windproof and weather resistant. Over five feet of paracord attached to rod. Provides up to 5,000 degree sparks in any weather, in any altitude. Extremely durable and reliable. 
Perfect fire starter for bushcraft, hiking, hunting, fishing, EDC, camping, barbecue, emergency, gas, camp stoves, etc. Sleek black anti-rust protective coating. Now, see how we're gonna have that's got to come out of there. There you go. This, of course, is your Blackbeard fire starter. Oh, it's got a little measuring thing on here. It, I'm pretty sure that's a bottle opener. And then this is what's going to do your zip and make your sparks. And then you have your little lanyard. And all of this can go in our little bag. In our kit. That's right. It's a kit. There we go. Blackbeard fire starters. That's going to go right here on the old table of contents with my other ones. So here's what we're going to do. We're gonna Let's just see how this stuff is going to go in the bag. Since that is a totally full pack right there, and I have the pack that Ben sent me, now this has to be charged. So I need to take that out, plug it in over there, and charge that up. Oh, okay. I was trying to unhook it from the wrong side there. Okay, that just rolls over top. You do that. Holy mackerel! That was like a switchblade lighter. Awesome. Oh, that thing's already... Did anybody else see that? That's very cool. These... Oh, right there. Okay, you plug into the side right there, and that will charge your lighter up. But it comes with, this is your lanyard, which it looks like goes through here. Then you're going to put that through here. Okay, once you got that going on there, then you have a clip. You squeeze that clip, you can break it loose to be able to light your stuff and put that back on. We're going to charge that up before we put that in the bag. And then, of course, you have your little USB cord that you would plug in to keep that good and charged, which we're going to do. Now let's take a look at this. Where would that go? Let's not put that there. Let's put this over here. Okay, so there you go. Yes, uh, the lighter's over there charging. Uh, you plug it in, a light comes on on the top of the lighter to let you know that it's charging. And I'm going to have to read a little bit more on it to find out whether or not it, uh, what it does when it lets you know that it's charged. I have to figure that out. Um, but I'm sure one way or the other I'm going to find out. So anyway, there you go. That, that's what's going on with me right now. That's what's happening with uh, the great outdoors. I have partnered up with the uh, Blackbeard Fire people. So if you think that maybe a Blackbeard Fire Starter kit like you just saw, or maybe just some fire starters, some fire plugs, might be something that you're interested in. Well, check out their website. You can go to the description down below. You can click on the link, take you right to it, take a good look at everything they have. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I truly appreciate you. We'll see you on the next one, whatever the next one may be. But what are you waiting for? I don't have anything else to say that. Just go on. Where did that come from? Spare parts laying all over the place.